A layer of smoke hovers over Creekside Park while hundreds of people flock to the fields. I think it's probably worse now than it than it has been. It doesn't seem to be affecting play. I've heard a couple of coaches mention it, but but nothing so far. Skylar Aldridge saw the smoke and was concerned about her game. I was worried if we weren't going to play the game. The smell is still in the air, but games go on and proud parents cheer for their all star. The tournament schedule is jam packed with playoffs. While Caitlin warms up for her game, the smoke is not an issue. It's what causes it. It worries me because I've been hearing a lot about places having forest fires and like scares me like we might get it. But coaches keep them focused. I really uh, hadn't discussed with our team about the smoke because that's just something I don't want them to even think about. What they need to think about is coming down here and this barren play. Within the hour, it's clear, but something else threatens the tournament. The wind has picked up, so the smoke is out, but now there are dark clouds overhead, which could mean rain. If it rains, we just have to work the schedule, try to work it in. Moments later, it starts raining, but it doesn't dampen spirits. Teams keep playing and fans make adjustments or find cover. In Craven County, Tori Shaw, News Channel 12.